Hi class, uh, welcome to IS458. I'm uh, Professor Fahmi Jalani. Uh, today we're covering lecture 10 uh, for space research. Uh, what I mean is uh, doing research on the internet, not in the orbit. Okay, let's uh, take a look at some of the topics that we're covering, uh, how search works, how it to monetize it and the importance of strategy. Um, let's take a look at Google. Uh, take a look at overview, what actually happened, uh, how search work, things terms like crawling, indexing, processing, calculate re relevance, uh, fighting spam, uh, retrieving result and references. So. Overall, uh, we know Google was founded by Larry Page and Sergey Brin. Uh, they are a PhD student at Stanford in 1996. Uh, company located at Mountain View, California. Uh, it earns by uh, advertising, Play Store, many other things. Uh, we are familiar with that. Um, it, it runs thousands of uh, server, uh, i.e. Uh, Linux uh, around the world uh, for your search. So what actually usually happens uh, in a search uh, when a user does a query, it goes to the web server and then it index from the server and the document server and it returns um, the result to the user in a split second. Uh, those of us who are familiar with search okay for example uh, here there's a search for seo search engine optimizer uh, on the top here and uh, within 1.4 second okay the result is here okay uh, this is the result from uh, google and on, on the display here we see uh, other than the result we have a uh, search suggestion um, which Google was just okay. uh, take note uh, as you progress uh, they are keyword title this is basically text that is implemented in the HTML uh, most of us would know that okay uh, keyword in links for example where uh, website could have uh, hyperlinks and also uh, another one, uh, header one text. Okay, this could be embedded in the website. As you scroll down below, okay, um, Google will also uh, prompt you about related search. Uh, uh, that other people would uh, search or could be in interest of you. Okay, so how does uh, Google search work? Uh, we have crawling, indexing, processing, okay. calculate relevance, fighting spam, and retrieving result. So, as a user does the query, okay, um, Google will uh, process it by uh, fetching all the website link to link to the uh, query. Uh, this software called a crawler or spider or maybe Google Bot. Right. Uh, it will go through the list of their server uh, technically the whole internet okay and from there it was like we saw the result just now uh, based on their uh, could be based on their title or keyword or could be text or header okay. here is illustration of uh, crawler and spider okay where the top are uh, the main crawler spider and then it will link to the rest okay, finding the website indexing uh, you see illustration of library okay, uh, the database for example okay um, so after every search there will be uh, index okay, stored in the database 
Uh, so it will be easier for that to be retrieved, not only you by you, maybe for other uh, search user. Okay. Um, next by algorithm. So when you search, you want to be accurate, and uh, Google will try to uh, give you the best. Okay. Then through uh, certain algorithms and clues. And processes and formula, you will get the end result. Uh, for example, uh, it could be autocomplete, freshness, site page quality, safe search, and cinnamon. Synony synonym. How do you calculate uh, by content? Okay. Um, Google will do a keyword search. Um, also, we meant covered on title, uh, is the HTML code, uh, programming, uh, header one, okay, alternate text, okay, um, could be hyperlink, yeah, to give you the best result. Having said that, uh, there are also uh, bogus or spam, uh, fake uh, website, and Google is fighting the war. Um, and it will uh, bar or block certain uh, blacklist website uh, that they think is uh, not relevant. Okay. Retrieving the result. Okay. Uh, so as Google uh, retrieves the result, they will display it to the user uh, for both matching factor within second okay next we take a look at how to monetize it okay uh, for search um, there's search monetize software okay uh, mobile apps um, website extension okay uh, desktop application okay, this type of software can match target ads with consumer search result by adding a few lines or code to the website. Okay. Uh, these two can monetize uh, search in one or two ways. First, uh, monetize software can redirect desktop or mobile search queries from website extension, browsers, mobile directly to the search partner like Google, Bing, Yahoo. Okay. Second, uh, these two can also have capabilities to integrate search box directly to a business. Uh, website mobile app extension okay, essentially uh, it's trying to make money from search uh, um, those of us who do regular search uh, you'll see uh, sp sponsor uh, ad on Google website uh, that's how Google make money okay. um, maybe in the olden days they do pop up but uh, it's not more popular right now and we have pop up blocker too so next it compare uh, between uh, monetizing and growth okay your monetization uh, strategy basically linked to the products lifecycle business right. uh, essentially all uh, website needs to make money okay uh, some startup won't focus on making money at all but instead acquire of basis of technology they built or talent they have recruited okay if a uh, startup you are a startup basically you know upfront that you are not seeking to generate meaningful revenue until you reach a number of user uh, you need to make clear decision to set your investment goal uh, based upon this okay, even you don't have revenue generate generation baked into your product from day one okay, it's, uh, it's worth considering what your revenue stream might be in the future okay? If there, there is no potential path to monetize in the future, this can be a problem for your product and for your business. Okay, take note. So, when should you monetize? Uh, essentially, here we have a diagram between seller and customer happiness. Okay, um, Between you and the seller, uh, if you exchange the paid and you under-deliver, the imbalance of uh, exchange in favor, okay, the indifference 
you basically or guilt and the guilt will lead to a resentment of your own customer okay customer feel cheated okay they will either never deal with you again or you go away go out of your way to spread the negative opinion um, of you to others right so basically people bad customer could go viral fair exchange the low they paid a low but fair price for what they receive so satisfied they are satisfied both person are satisfied <coughs> and uh, alternatively uh, they paid price which was too low considering that they achieved imbalance of exchange in favor of customer you be, you could begin to descend your customer you won't deliver to your fullest you can create a sense of guilt again you manage to seek relieve that guilt by minimizing you as a seller okay so you can get complaints uh, more demanding customer charge back more trouble okay um, let's invest and general engage if they fit paid fair uh, but higher price you promise outcome was delivered in time so you are happy uh, your customer are happy and they could come uh, as a return customer or recommend them to other customer or consumer so monetizing for fun and profit uh, I advise you take it slow uh, if you're going to increase your revenue okay increase your value don't let short-term revenue blind you for long term okay try not to make fast money uh, don't just expect to solve uh, the money problem later uh, but it's viable and feasible in the long run Okay, next we take a look at uh, search space. Okay. The strategic importance of search. Uh, here we have six steps. Uh, we have uh, first is to step one, spend time, some time thinking about your topic. So basically when you do a search or if you're creating a website itself. Uh, what would the customer look, look for? Clarify and define your research question. Break down search topic into section. Think of the keywords, for example. Uh, next step two, considering your search terms. Uh, generic words. Uh, discuss, access, important. Consider alternative terms, firms or businesses. Uh, alternative spelling, organization with a S or Z. Like behavior with a U or not. Three linking your search term together. Um, it could be and, uh, for example, uh, retailing and marketing, okay, uh, workspace or organization things like that. Number four, uh, choose your database. Um, database sub could be subjected, okay. Uh, searching and modifying your search online. Uh, database you will use different search okay uh, subject author text uh, title for example uh, relevant result okay um, is the item full text direct to what or you wanted is it accurate okay uh, could you give the best result to be value to your customer so that's pretty much it for search. Uh, if you have any question, please email me. Uh, also, uh, you can uh, drop by my office. Um, stay safe and thank you very much. Bye bye.